What up, what's my ladies and gentlemen? It's your boy Jess. Welcome back to another Madden 17 video. Today we are gonna go ahead and take a look at the new Mel Blunt that just came out. You can see I already had it pre-searched. I was already looking at this beautiful bastard. First and foremost, man, I really want to go ahead and just thank you guys and all the feedback on yesterday's video. It really, 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 really just felt awesome to know that the time and effort that went into it, you guys enjoyed it. And I think we're going to slow down on the amount of videos that I post. Um, I should be able to easily handle about two of those a day. So every day I can at least get you guys two gameplays that style. Um, and, you know, I'm going to do live commentaries from now on. Just do them that way. And, and, and hopefully, you know, it brings... At the end of the day, uh, you know, I know I'm not a good Madden player. I know I'm not a great Madden player. I'm good, but, you know, I'm not great. But, you know, at the end of the day, I don't do this to showcase my skills. You know, uh, if I look at the comments, man, and, and if you were to able to just chuckle or crack a smile or just forget about whatever it is that's going on in your life, man, there's a lot of people that send me messages, um, whether it's Twitter DMs or whether it's um, through Gmail. You know, there's a lot of people that, you know, watch my videos and they're going through... You know, parents are going through divorces, they get bullied, um, you know, they're at the hospital, you know, uh, they got hurt or in some type of accident or something or, you know, whatever the case may be, um, you know, just to my goal is to just try and make you forget about the world eight to ten minutes at a time. You know, if you can watch this video, forget about all your problems, forget about everything that's going on wrong with you because you guys do that for me. You know, I play these games to get you guys content. I stream to... Uh, you know, get you guys content, stuff like that. Whenever I'm editing, whenever I'm playing, I don't think about anything. My mind is free. My mind is clear. You know, I'm, I don't I don't think about, you know, all of the crazy things that are going on in my life. And it's just awesome to know that a lot of people enjoyed it, you know, were able to put a smile on your face. And that's my goal, man. And if I can continue to do that, uh, then I'm going to try my best to do so. So I have two gameplays coming for you guys later on today. Hopefully you guys enjoy that. And, you know, the likes are definitely very motivating. Um, you know, sharing them on Facebook, I see the shares, definitely motivating. It takes 12 seconds for you to go on there and hit the like button, uh, you know, um, post it on your Facebook, like it on Facebook and stuff like that. And that just it lets me know that you just really appreciate the time and effort that's going in because I appreciate your effort of watching the video. This is a two-way street. I can go on ahead and paint the best picture in the world but if there's nobody there to watch it and let me, if there's nobody there to, to look at it and let me know I'm doing a good job, then it kind of defeats the purpose, you know? So, you know, I, I appreciate your feedback. I appreciate you guys, the effort you guys put in to watching the content. Because, again, it's a two-way street. You know, I deliver the content and you, I sound like a drug dealer, <laughs> and you guys watch it, you know? And and uh, I truly, bottom of my heart, thank you guys. I, I Reading that comment section yesterday, and I was looking at it a little earlier today. I'm sorry, I'm going to get into Mel Blunt in a second. It's just... Um, it was just, uh, the feedback was incredible, and it put such a big smile on my face, and I was so just happy to know so many people said they found it funny, and to say that they laughed, and to say they had a smile on their face, and oh my goodness, man, it, it was such an incredible feeling, and I, I appreciate that, guys. Thank you guys very much. Now that I'm getting all sentimental on you guys, let's take a look at the Mel Blunt that was released today, and this card looks amazing so he has big hitter tier two what well, times two and he has the uh past chemistry times two 93 speed 93 acceleration 90 agility 94 man coverage 91 zone coverage 95 press 92 play record 73 catching not to mention big hitter is going to give him you know plus two i believe it adds one block shed two hit power um a strength uh, but this right here, when you unlock tier two, is another speed. So he's gonna go up to 94 speed, fully maxed out. Um, his block shed, he's gonna add a block shed, a power move, another hit power, a finesse move, and he should 100% be a 99 overall, maxed out with both chemistries. Let's go ahead and, and take a look. 77 strength for cornerback. That is definitely quite a bit. Uh, not, like I said, 93 speed, which is definitely good. Uh, but you know, obviously, we know Mel Blunt for being a uh, a night train lane type guy. You know, somebody who's very physical, somebody who can hit very hard. You know, create turnovers for you, help you in the run game by evading uh, blocks from receivers or tight ends and stuff like that. And uh, this card is definitely not a letdown. 
We scroll down and we take a look and we see that he has uh, 50 power moves, 65 finesse move, 77 block shed, almost 80 block shed. And I believe, if I'm not mistaken, I believe Field General, um, which he does not have. I believe Big Hitter Tier 2 does give you a uh, one block shed. I believe so. Hopefully I'm not mistaken. But uh, if it does, and you also get a block shed from the uh, past chemistry for the Super Bowls of past, that's going to bring his block shed up to almost 80 as a cornerback. Now, that is that that is a lot of block shed. You know, that is a lot. And that is, you know, going to help out in the run game so, so, so much. You know, the fact that he can actually play the run. And he's going to be able to uh, not only play the run, he's going to be able to hit. And he's going to be able to hit hard. Let me go on ahead and let me look up his traits really quickly before I uh, get into it. He should, you know, definitely have big hitter uh, trait, yes. But, okay, clutch, yes, big hitter, yes. High motor, yes, strips ball, yes, play balls in air, aggressive. He, that's literally green light on every single chemistry possible. I mean, uh, trait, so that is amazing. So, clutch, yes, I'm not sure how that coexists, coincides with the game. I'm not sure what they consider clutch and how they perform. I, I don't know. But I do know big hitter, that's visual. I can see that. I can see that. Uh, he's he uh, hit sticks by himself. You don't need to click on and go for bigger. He's going to do that majority of the time just by himself. Uh, strips ball. Yes, you can see that there's certain players in the game that just go for strips on their own when you don't click on and try to go for it manually. Just does it on his own, you know, and which is awesome. You know, those are pluses. Those are definitely things to try and help you all create turnovers, and that is a, a plus when uh, you know you're looking to spend a lot of coins on a player. It's definitely beneficiary when you got players that can just do extra things for you. Um, his pursuit, 90. Play rec, 92. Man coverage, 94. Zone coverage, 91. Now, he doesn't have the best coverage. Um, his main coverage is pretty good, but his zone coverage is at 91. Not the best, but, you know, all around, you know, he's just going to be an amazing player just because, again, he can really help with both aspects of the, the offense when it comes to rushing and when it comes to uh, passing, like somebody like Deion Sanders, like I had Deion Sanders and DRC um, at one time at my number one and number two corners. Good Lord, it was disgusting. Uh, we're trying to stop the run, and they don't tackle very well. They don't block shed anything. They're, they're coverage guys, you know. And Mel Blunt is just a different animal, you know. So uh, I'll take a little less coverage for a lot, a lot of run support. Uh, what's his hit power looking like? 91 hit 91 hit power guys 91 as a cornerback and not to mention fully maxed out he's going to get three more hit power he's going to get two more from the big hitter and he's going to get one more from the maxed out super bowl legend super bowl past he's going to have 94 hit power with 94 speed 94 acceleration 95 man, 92 zone, because everything from the past pretty much just goes up plus one. And um, except, you know, big hitter, is that's going to be plus two um, hit power already with the plus one that the pass gives. So that is just, that's that's astronomical. You know, I had the 92 overall Mel Blunt. Um, I had this card when it came out for the longest. And uh, his coverage was frustrating. I won't lie. His coverage was frustrating. Out of all the cornerbacks I had, he was getting beat more often than not. Um, you know, because I played a, a lot of man coverage. That's when I was in uh, the time where I was just in love with man coverage. And um, more often than not, he would be the one to get burnt than the other guys. Just because his man coverage just it just wasn't the best. So his man coverage on this one, a uh, little better. Uh, the, the speed definitely helps get more velocity when he's revving up. To get to the bar carrier, to go ahead and lay the wood. Um, you know, that press, that speed, that hip power, he's just going to be a physical monster. And I 100% want this card. 100%. Now, I think I'm a hold strong. I have 21,000 points due from all the points I bought um, when the Super Bowl bundle dropped. They do have flashback packs out. And I wanted to try and open them yesterday for John Elway. I was like, you know, if John Elway came out today, then. Um, because John Elway is a monster. Like, most likely, the card coming out tomorrow is going to be even better. 
And it is. And Mel Blunt is monstrous. Um, but it's like, you know what? The same uh, thing is going to apply. You know, tomorrow is Legend Weekend. And I think that um, if they drop another Legend tomorrow, it should be even better than what Blunt is going to be. So Blunt is less than a million. So I got to try and uh, work my way up to get that so I can get him. The cornerback I'm going to sell is probably going to be DRC. It's definitely between him and Dion. Either or, I'm not a fan of of either just because they don't press very well. And uh, for my number four, number five corners, I need you to press because you're only coming on the field when I'm in quarters 95% of the time. And when I'm in quarters, it's just, you know, man defense. Just man up across the board, body on the body. You know, I got millions of coins on these cornerbacks, and I need them to stick to the wide receiver and, you know, try to hope for a block shed, damn it. <laughs> um and uh, they, they just don't press well. Dion gets beat too often for me because I rely heavily on the press. And uh, so does DRC. But uh, either way, I'm probably going to replace one of those two guys. More like more likely than not DRC. I mean, more likely it's going to be DRC because I have uh, Dion as my return uh, specialist. And he does a pretty good job for me at that. So most likely it's going to be DRC. But nonetheless, I definitely 100% want that card. The card looks really, really, really glitchy. And um, definitely looking forward to going ahead and, and getting him and seeing what it is he can provide for my squadron. Or maybe I'll just get rid of A.J. Bouye, who's been amazing. A.J. Bouye is highly recommended. That card has been very, very, very good for me. But I only have him for the Houston chemistry um, where Dion and, uh, Dion and DRC have better coverage than him. But he definitely has better press and he's more physical. But maybe I'll just get rid of A.J. Bouye and just let... You know, just lose out on that Houston chemistry. Just let J.J. Watt and Clowney be the 98s that they were desired to be. And, uh, you know, just keep DRC and Dion with Mel Blunt and uh, Chris Harris and, you know, all the goons I got. We'll see. I'm not sure. But anyways, that's the end of the video, fellas. Let me know in the comment section what do you guys think of this card. Again, two new gameplays coming out later on today. Hopefully, you guys are looking forward to that. And, again, I'm new to all this stuff, so I'm trying my best to try and be, you know, there's some people like, you're so dramatic when it's like, you know, when you're doing a live commentary and you know it's going to be watched for entertainment purposes, you have to try and be that. You have to try and, you know, be entertaining it. 95% um, of it is just real aggression with me in the game. And there's, you know, 5% is me being dramatic and overly trying to be entertaining so you guys enjoyed the video. But, um, like, if I'm playing by myself and I'm not recording, then, like, I wouldn't get upset vocally i mean i would but it'll be in my mind you know i wouldn't express it you know because there's a mic on you know but because there is a mic on and i'm trying to be entertaining there are going to be times where you may think i'm being overly dramatic and stuff like that nine again 95 percent of it is real aggression and anger and then i'm sprinkling five percent of of uh, overdoing it because you know i'm just trying to you know have you guys enjoy the video and hopefully crack a smile you know but um yeah two of those are coming out hopefully you guys enjoy them um i'm getting um you know, we're going to slow down from the five videos a day. Um, again, I'm going to try and do two gameplays. You know, I'm, I'm going to get you guys covered on the month news every single time there's a new card out or, you know, things like that. Get you guys up to date with the news and stuff. But as far as gameplays, when there is no news or anything like that coming out, it'll probably be just two a day uh, with this editing style. And uh, just hopefully you guys, you know, enjoy it. I'm going to try my best to, you know, make sure you guys enjoy it. And, and uh, hopefully you guys uh, recognize the effort that are going into these and, and, uh, you know, hopefully we can continue to get views, likes, and shares and stuff like that. And, you know, together we'll continue to try and uh, entertain each other, man, one video at a time. It's your boy GS, man. We'll see you guys.